Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Leslie and this is my living room. I'm fresh back from the beach vacation with the family. We had an awesome time. I am definitely in need of coffee so I made a full 16 ounces today. <laughs> Uh, I am going, I took, I unpacked already, so we won't be sharing that. I just took everything out of my suitcase, put it where it belonged, wiped it down, put it where it belonged. Any clothing, anything like that can go in the washer. It's going in the washer today, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to work on some laundry. I'm hoping to get into the attic and start going through my fall bins to see what I want to keep here at the house versus what I would like to take to work. So, other than that, I don't really know what I have planned for today because uh, three sips in, it's gonna take a little bit more. Um, but, you know, let's just see what happens. So there's not too much laundry. Basically, it is um, <coughs> sheets from my bed, darks and lights, and just going to get that started. Not sure what's on my lens. There we go. Probably sand. <coughs> so anyway, let's just get started. All right, so while the clothes, first load of clothes is washing, I'm going to get up in the attic. It's about 10.30 a.m. I don't know what the temperature is outside, but, you know, I don't know that I'm going to make it too long up there. I'm going to try and get a little bit done today and then get back up in there after the sun sets, maybe. We'll see. All right, so before I start pulling anything down from the attic, I need to go around the house and pull up all of the July 4th decorations. Then I need to make a checklist so I can stay on task and know what I want to do. So first, let's go around and pull all of the July 4th.
I've decided to bring the bins down and go through them, figure out what I want and what I don't want. Because if I don't have the strength or the energy to pull these things up and down the attic, I've got too much that I don't need. So I'm going to separate want, home, no, sorry, home, office, donate. Take a little seat here. I emptied one bin. It's in that bag. Then I have three more bins of fall. And then I have a bag of my um, shoe bins. I don't know what they're called. Uh, that I got from Walmart a big bulk of them for real cheap. It was awesome I got 30 of them and they hold all of my smaller items my tiered tray items If you've been with me for a while, you've seen that whole process um, I have Some of my July 4th. I've gotten all of it down from down here, but I also have some up in the extra bedroom closet because I was like oh yeah I'll bring out this season and then next season put this season out then take that up and put the next season it that didn't work so we'll see if fall and winter fall and Halloween work we'll try it with that um, and the reason why I'm doing all of this today when I usually don't is because a I have the energy B I have the time See, I have got to get through all of these bins, get rid of what I don't need, only keep what I need to. I'd really like to get down to like maybe just the three bins of fall. I am going to take some of it to work that will match with my work decor, but like I said, I don't have a lot of decorating space. I'll have to see if I can hang some uh, shelves or something in there to hold decor and make it a little bit more fun we'll see so for right now i am going to empty these bins and then lay it all out on the floor and then we're going to go through see what i have we might just do one bin at a time i don't know what to do uh all right, let me move this July 4th up to the attic, and on my way up and back down, I'll figure it out, and you know, we'll get going. Before I left on vacation, I did set up my fall mugs, so that would help to motivate me to pull out all of my fall decorations. So it's all of my Ray Dunn mugs with just a normal pumpkin mug. This one says pumpkin spice, and on the other side it says everything nice. This one says hay rides. I think it says something. Nope. Maybe it's the oh my gourd. I love fall. Oh, oh that one has the cute little pumpkin on the back. Yeah, I'm trying to reach over a chair. It's not going well. So anyway, I hung those up. And now I'm seeing some July 4th that I need to take care of. Which would be this. Uh, but these just get folded up and put into my sideboard drawers. Alright, so I bought 30 of these boxes from Walmart. You know, you can put shoes in them, you can put whatever in them. I use them to keep smaller decor, things that I use on my tiered trays. I even went so far as to number them 1 through 30 because I was going to make a list that said 7 had July 4th in it and 12 had December in it. Not when you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, just a fall. That's not Halloween. That's not summer. That's just pumpkins, leaves, acorns, squirrels. Okay, it's a problem. It is a problem. So the numbering system, 
They're see-through. I can see what's in them. Okay. <laughs> nice try, Les. All right. So here's what I did. I have a tiered tray full of all my little trinkets. I'm just going to take them off the tiered tray, separate them out. This tiered tray I got from Walmart. It was $15. I was so excited about it. And the screw is stripped in the wood and it won't stay on. So I'm going to have to take like uh, wood filler or wood glue or something and just fix it. Because we ain't doing all that. My Uncle Sam's and my Statue of Liberty are my most prized possessions. I will never get rid of these. These are precious. These I got from the Target dollar spot years ago. The Stars and Stripes. Love them. Love them. Alright, we're not going to reminisce. We're not reminiscing. I have a problem with that, y'all. So then I'm just going to continue placing stuff right down in here. And all of this will go to work with me. This is going to be my work decor. Might have already said that. I need to empty a full bin so that I can get this in there or a bag. Well, no, not a bag. I want it in a bin. Um, and put this 4th of July in it. So, <laughs> we'll start with one on top. I had forgotten that I kept my microwave box and my coffee box to pack items to take to my office. So all of that 4th of July that's going to my office will go into these boxes. Fabulous. Alright, so I went up and took some stuff up actually to the second floor because in that closet I have strawberries and lemons decor and the rest of my July 4th. So I shoved all that in that one, except for the lemons and stuff. That will go in a separate bin. But all of the July 4th shoved in that bin. Um, and, mm, You got pretty, boy boys. You got what? Um, found my outdoor fall decor. So this, um, I can put this up now until I, till like, you know, September 1st. Uh, and you will never find this. This is from the Christmas tree shops. And I liked it because it was different from everything else that everybody else had. I loved what they had, but I wanted something different. And I bought this for $16.99 at Christmas Tree Shop. I think it was last fall. And I, I mean to tell you, my heart bleeds and aches and cries. Every time I look at something and I've left that Christmas Tree Shop, or I know that I bought it at the Christmas Tree Shops, it breaks my 
heart. I loved that store. Right. Next bucket. Little leaves, my mini tear trays, very cute when I put this on it, my mini or acorns, and my mini squirrels. It is precious. I'm taking these to work. This would go good at work. It's a Christmas tree shop. <laughs> I have more of this. I'm going to take this to work. I feel like I got this from the dollar store. And they're really pretty. This goes on my stove top, on my little riser, and then I put a fall candle in the middle of it. Keep. This is cute. This can go to my office. I'd have to fix the leaves and everything, but that coloring goes with my rusty kind of colors. Blues will go to my office. This we will keep. This is for a really Halloween. Big lots. Acorns. Want. I know this is a dollar store one. These are dollar store ones, but I actually really like these. I think I'm going to take these to work. This was Dollar store, I don't know. Um, this is actually Halloween. These bright oranges I saved for Halloween. Um, the whites, the blues, the tans, the creams, the light greens, all of that is going to work. Now, this. Shall I take it to work and fill it with coffees or pumpkins or, wait a minute. Dollar store, dollar store, these can go. I'm gonna let all of this really cheapo dollar store stuff go because I've got so many pumpkins I just don't need all of them this is for late fall or October this can this is actually a dollar store one but it's that red so that can go this green I'll keep this orange I'll keep this is becoming the office pile for some reason this still has the dollar on it have this color in my office. Let's see. Now we'll go to the office. This will go to the office. I don't know if this is Christmas tree or Hobby Lobby or Dollar General. We don't know. I don't like this one. I got it from Walmart. I just don't like it. This is a Dollar Tree one. We'll just put that in the pile. These I got last year and didn't get a chance to use, so I'm really excited to use these picks. I could even put, you know, one down in a jar. And then have, you know, the leaves coming up and around it. Something like that. So, definitely keeping these. 
my battery's about to die. This can, this little gray pumpkin, I don't, I'm going to put him to the side for a moment. Another one of these white dollar store ones. This one actually goes with Halloween. This one goes in a specific bowl, as bowl filler. This one is a dollar store one that can be donated. Yeah, we're going to donate them. These are Halloween. We got another acorn. 